perfect. 10 rounds of 40 seconds. Start. Ha. Super good. Oh, bird dog. Right here. So set up right arm, left leg. Get your balance. Elbow to knee and reach. Elbow to knee. I tuck my toes under of that opposite leg. That helps, seems to help with the balance more. If you don't have shoes on, it may be that if your foot is flat, you have better balance. Reach and touch the elbow to your knee. Reach. So 40 second round. Stay solid. Excellent. Nicely done. All right, let's change sides. So now left arm, right leg. All right, spread your fingers, tuck your left toes under, reach the right leg straight. Don't lift the leg high, just go straight out. And then reach the arm beside the ear, right there. Stay with me. Don't shift your body back. You want your shoulder over your wrist. In, extend. In, extend. In, extend. Super good. Strong core. Lift or reach the elbow to knee and then reach the arm and leg, not lifting. Reach. Nicely done. That felt like 40 seconds, didn't it? Yeah, I thought so. Okay, bicycle. All the way down on your back. And hopefully your head can go straight, go flat. And then bicycle, touch, reach, reach. Elbow to knee, go slow, touch. Touch, now speed it up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Go slow for three, two, go fast. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Go slow for four, fast. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Go slow, four. And you're done. Nice counting. Okay, bring it up. Superman's. So unilateral. So on your belly. And reach your arms and your legs. Look down at your mat. Press your pelvis down and then lift the left leg and right arm and lower. When you do that, I want you to raise the chest just slightly and lower. Don't just lift the limbs. So a little lift to the chest and then lower. Up and lower. Not too high. Up. I find that it's a little more effective if I tuck my right toes under and I have that leverage to lift the limbs. The limbs being the right arm and the left leg. And if you're a taller person, this is harder because you have heavier limbs. <laughs> okay, other side. So you can come into sphinx pose for a moment, like this. Press the floor away, nice spine stretch. All right, here we go. So now the opposite side. So you wanna lift the left arm, right leg, and then lower. Lift the chest. I am slightly pressing into my arm. And then of course my toes tucked under back there. That leg. Lift up and lower. Lift, lower. Up and down. Lift and lower. You got it. Up, down. Lift, lower. Up. Lift. Nicely done. All right, you're gonna flip over. You can just roll over on your back or I'm gonna just turn all the way over. And next is scissor kicks. 
So we'll, st we'll do slow and then quicker movement. I'll count it out for you. So lower down, and you want to reach your arms to the sides like this, and then four, three, slow, two, one. Now quick, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, slow, four, three, wider, two, one, fast, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, slow, four, three, two, if it's too much, stop now, four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and slow, four, three, two, one, go eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, feet down, nicely done, let's see what's next, I have my list, oh, butterfly crunches, so look, you are cross your ankles, and you'll bring your knees apart and towards your chest and touch the bottom of your shoes, and then separate your legs and arms, and then change the crossing and touch, and you don't have to get your feet, legs parallel to the floor, in fact, it's easier on the back if you just reach at an angle upwards. But if you feel strong, you can reach straighter. But you don't want to fill your back. This is for your core crunch. Reach the arms. So nothing wrong with having the legs go up at an angle right there. Crunch, open, butterfly, reach. Nice. How you doing? Okay. We got three more moves. Crunch with the crossing your chest, and then we'll use the dumbbell, okay? So crunches. Cross your heart. Feet on the floor. Keep the feet on the floor. Crunch. Pulse. Four, three, two. Now slow go for four. Three, two, pulse for eight. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, slow it down for four, three, two, pulse right here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, nicely done. Okay, so now you're gonna grab a dumbbell. We'll do the same count using the dumbbell. Haha, oh, feels heavy. I've got a 12 pounder. <laughs> then you can use a 10 pounder if you want. So hold it right there. Up four, three, two, one, pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, slow, four, three, tap your head down, two, one, pulse, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, slow, four, three, two, one. The last move, flutter kicks. That means your legs are going to do this. Okay, <laughs> if you could see that. <laughs> so, my fingers like this. Okay, so head on the floor first. Give your neck a break. Give your jaw a break. Then, so you're going to make, make fists, arms in front like this, and then reach your legs up like this at an angle. Lift up your shoulder blades and move your legs like this. Four, three, two and quicker eight seven six five four three two one and slow four three two one it's quick eight seven six five four three two one slow four three two one eight seven six five four three two one and you're done awesome work Super, super good job, everybody. Okay, a few stretches. 
cross your ankles and roll up. Come onto your hands and your knees. Round your back. Cat. Cow. Cat. And then cow. Right here, cat. And cow. Walk your hands in and reach your arms up and stretch overhead. Step your right foot forward and reach your hips forward like that. Hand on the floor, reach up the right arm and then rotate under and move your right foot over. So reach and rotate, best mobility move you can do for your warm up or your cool down. One more, nicely done, hamstring stretch. Do it on the other side and then you're out of here. All right, lift up your head, lift up your chest, knee down, opposite foot forward, shift forward, hand on the floor, reach up, rotate under, reach up, rotate under. Do it again. Nicely done. Walk it back. Hamstring stretch. Nice. Awesome work, people. Thank you so much for joining me. Foot on the ground, stand all the way up. Inhale, reach up. Give yourselves a hand. Thank you so much for showing up and spending this power hour with me. I'll see you again next time. <laughs>